Sean, so that's uh, you know two consecutive games we've seen. You know, down the stretch, I felt like we had to kind of make some big plays for this team. Did, did you feel like that? You know, like you did really on Thursday. Um, I mean, really, it's, it goes really to my my teammates. I mean, them guys. When when it's late like that, they they see they find some way to just find me, and I just I just go to the to the foul line and just do my job. I mean, those guys, those are the ones that's really getting me to um getting me the fouls and getting me the the free throws. So I'm just being a senior and just trying to sit here and seal the game. How much of a struggle was it for you today, just shooting once? Um, it was. I mean, it's it's tough. I mean, playing under the weather is it's terrible. So what was terrible? Sorry. You don't feel well at all. No. What's, what's the matter? You sick. What's that? <laughs> 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 right. So, have you felt how long you felt that? <laughs> oh man, you gonna make this a topic? No. Man, he's been he's been sick since we got back. <laughs> So what's it say about him, Justin, that he did what he did even though he was sick? In SK is SK. He's going to come perform every night. I mean, sick or not sick, he's going to play basketball. That's what he loves to do. And that's what I expected out of him. That's what he came to do. Justin, how important was it to, to win this game? You know, Thursday night was obviously very big for this program, this team, to, to come I mean, back to it was very big. It's more bigger than Louisville game just because of uh, I mean, you come off a big win like that, I mean, everyone thinks you're going to let up and take the L at home, but, I mean, we're trying to show the world that we're not playing and we're really here to win and we're really here to be the best team we want to be and we can be. This is a team you don't match up very well against. You struggled with them again at South Florida. You guys were tied at that point at the 847 mark. You were down by one at the 847 mark here. All right. What is it about this team that makes it so difficult for you? Uh, South Florida is a, it's a pretty big team. <laughs> they play pretty big down low, and they got size, and they got size on the ring. So they are, that means they're a good rebounding team. So they can't shoot the ball that well, but they can offer a rebound. So that means that's a plus, you know what I'm saying? So, and we're not that big, so we just came off a game, so it's not really like they had a whole week prepare, and we just had come off, come back. So it was like an NBA game. You have to get a day off and you come right back. So, I mean, you just got to grind it out. I mean, it's bigger than us, so we just have to box out and make sure we can just rebound. How much of a team effort was it keeping them off the offensive class? Because it seemed, I mean, obviously it was a focus, and you guys did pretty well. Um, I mean, it was it was a really huge team effort. I mean, we got to we we try to find little ways just to try to help Titus and um, and Justin out. I mean, those are our two anchors down low, and those are the guys that really get us going with the rebounding um, aspect and being able to. Um, just really box, box the um, USF team out. I mean, Justin does a tremendous job when it comes to that because he, he can actually box everyone out and he can actually grab the rebound. So that's a plus for us. You had one turnover in the first half and then five in about the first five minutes of the second half. Was that just a mental lapse or was it turning pressure up? Or how, how do you explain that? It's hard basketball. Yeah, just really rushing. Just really rushing and, um, I mean, just not really cutting hard to the ball. I mean, that's what happens. I mean. It's, it's part of the whole game. As big as they are, Justin, was it a matter of just using your quickness offensively to, to have the success you did? Um, just going at them. Just, I mean, yeah, the quickness. And I, I do have a little bit of strength under me. So I mean, I'm just going to go at them and just play my game. And that's what I did. To win 14 straight in your first 10 in conference, kind of just a thought on where this team is at this point, how much you guys enjoy this kind of stretch of playing right now. We're not done yet. I mean, I mean, that's a, that's a big, that's a big accomplishment. But I mean, we're not here just to have a, um, just to be undefeated and lose when it's time to win. You know what I'm saying? So we want to get better every day and just make sure we need to do what we need to do to win all the games we need to win. Because we want to be on the big stage when it's time to come to March. That's our main focus: to make sure when we get to March, we have a good seed and do what we need to do. Because that's all the only thing that matters. Well, it's coming, Sean. No national respect. We don't care. You'll get the national respect this week. Without a doubt, you'll be you'll be, you'll be in top ten. 
so the target will be squarely on the back. So what does it mean? If you finally get the accolades that you say this team deserves, does it actually mean anything for next week? No. I mean, we're still going to play with the, with the chip on our shoulder like we've been playing throughout the whole year. And um, I mean, the number the number next to the the number next to the name don't really mean much because any team and any night can really come off and bump you. And that's something that, as a um, as three seniors like me, Jack, and Rob, we got to continue to keep instilling that in our young guys because I mean, the the younger guys are the ones that like really they pay attention to that because they're young. But the but the older guys and um. And like the juniors and the sophomores, they understand that. I mean, we've been in this position before, and it and it, and it went downhill before. But we got to continue to keep keep working. I mean, now it's a bigger bullseye on us, and we just got to continue to keep coming out with a with a better effort every night. Anything else? Thank you. Thanks, guys.